We want to teach designers and engineers how to understand what people want and how they work before we design things for them. It's hard to not think about HCD as being unique. There's no department, I, I think, in the whole country that's, that says we're human-centered design and engineering. There's aspects of computer science, um, design, uh, informatics, uh, art, all kinds of different disciplines that are within it. I think one of the most exciting things happening uh, in the industry right now is just all the advancements that are being made in technology and with the focus of user experience. So all of the different apps that are coming out, websites, physical products. So we're trying to understand what the different burdens are that these types of technologies place on people and how we can sort of address those burdens through different design approaches. The people that do this work often have skill sets that are in multiple different types of academic fields. And so my work combines computer science and social science. We've got faculty that come from a humanities background. We have faculty that come from an engineering background. We have faculty that come from a computer science background. And we actually try to integrate a lot of the great research that the faculty in our department are doing um, into the curriculum. So students in the, the program will have the opportunity to sign up for what we call directed research groups so they can take credit-based research um, and, and dig into to problems that you know, the, no one has ever looked at before, um, trying to push the edge of, of contributing to generalizable knowledge through those groups. Being in that kind of environment and talking about technology and user experience and getting to hear professors who are highly educated in the area, just, it was super invigorating for me. There are some classes that are focused on theoretical concepts. Some classes just focus mainly on the design aspect, so working on uh, prototyping and wireframes and creating some kind of test product that we could be able to evaluate out on the, on the field and and conduct experiments. The diversity of the students that we attract is great. There was a big mix from computer science, design and art, um, project management, people from just all different walks of life, all different industries were coming together to learn about user-centered design. We've got this growing tech industry around, um, anchored by Microsoft, but coming, we've got Amazon, we've got, all, we've got startups all over the place. So we've got this great community both of potential students who want to come back and get a master's degree, and also companies that can sponsor projects, that can hire students when they're finished. After my last day in HCDE, I got hired at Nordstrom, and currently I'm a senior user researcher now. I get to just focus on the user's experience, um, doing usability studies, but also research activities and finding how to better the um, site design and the app design. I started out as uh, a game designer intern at T-Mobile uh, after I graduated from, from the UW. Then I got promoted as a senior instructional designer. The program really made me feel confident. Confident that I could take on any of the work thrown at me out in the industry. It made me feel like I had the background to handle it. I mean, by now we're also